Hello everyone, I thought I'd do a video on my complete lighter collection. Now I'm not going to cover disposable lighters because I do have some disposable Bix, but that's uh, not really relevant. So here's all my uh, lighters that are at least refillable. Um, how long they'll last I don't know. Uh, one thing to mention is that I'm going to might struggle to get all this in frame, so apologies if something you know goes out of frame while I'm trying to film it. And I think this is all my lighters. Whether or not I've got another one laying around somewhere I've forgotten about, I don't know. But I'm only going to do one lighter of each type. Some of these I have multi packs of. Um, so we're going to start at the top left. And what we've got here is a Chinese Starlighter, copy of a Zippo. Basically, very similar to a Zippo, but not quite as good. The flame tends to flute a bit more than the Zippo, and um, it tends to run dry a little bit faster as well. It's quite hard to keep that all in frame properly. Anyway, so that's the um, Starlighter, basically just a Zippo. Now, here's the proper Zippo, brushed chrome one. Flame lights up better with a Zippo, even though I've already burnt the wick quite a lot down. Big fan of Zippo lighters, very cool. Now, for our next interesting lighter, it's an electric arc lighter. These are cool but impractical. You can light uh, cigarettes with them and incense, a candle if the wick's quite high but everything else you'll struggle with. So it's got that like, little electric arc there. And um, it recharges via USB. So it's a cool rechargeable lighter, looks cool, not all that practical. Um, now for the standard butane sort of lighters, what I call soft flame lighters. Clipper lighter, very uh, practical, very common fill it up with butane, this is a clear one use the flint, press the fuel button similar to a Bic, I prefer the clipper personally now for pipe lighters this is just some cheap pipe lighter I've got, it's got a pipe to the bottom if it lights up, this one isn't quite as good as some of my other ones there we go, it's finely lit and although it's electric ignition it doesn't light all that well when it works it's got quite a long flame but pipe lighters have angled flames basically so I think there's a bit of an air current that's disturbing the flame but yeah now this is a better pipe lighter I think it's the brands called Honest they do a few lighters lights up every time more satisfying click slightly longer flame all round good pipe lighter now there's this one sometimes this one gives me trouble sometimes it's alright looks like a bit like a dustbin Again, it's an angled pipe lighter. It has space for two flints in here, but I only have one, I think, currently in it. Oh, no, I do have two. Um, long flame on it when set to full. I find when you set this to lower, it doesn't light as well. But it's good when it works, but I find sometimes this one gives me a bit of trouble. Can't remember what brand it was. It was on Amazon. You can adjust this by turning the bottom without needing a screwdriver, which is nice. But out of all of them, this Honest pipe lighter is my favourite one. Right, now for jet lighters. Uh, I've done a lot of videos on these recently, but uh, we'll go through them all. These are tall jet ones. This is the closest you'll get to disposable ones. You can adjust the flame here on the front. It doesn't burn quite as hot as some of the others, and you can see it actually has more of a red flame rather than a blue flame. But you can get a pack of five of these for about three quid for five, less than a pound each. Pretty good for what they are. Now, uh, with all these prof ones, and this is a Coney one, they tend to be called either prof or Coney, and I have some go under different names as well. So these are probably generic Chinese jet lighters that get renamed from whichever company is doing it. So this is the angled one, this is one of my favourite designs. You hold it like that, press the ignition button in when it works, and you get a long, um, very hot jet flame. So, very practical. Next, we've got the same thing but with a metallic construction rather than plastic and this one's got two flames so exact same but two it's got an adjustment lever but it doesn't adjust the flames all that much when set to high they're only a little bit short on low but this is still very hot next we've got another metallic type one but this is a straight neck one only one flame works very well nice big you know single blue flame very hot again metallic construction so it's a bit stronger this is the hottest of more like more my lighters. It's um, a Coney triple flame. It's designed for lighting cigars. So when set to maximum, that is really hot. Like if I hold my hand there, that's uncomfortably hot. 
so yeah this is really good if you want to output a lot of heat quickly but it's not the best quality construction now uh, this is a prof um, basically flip open design like a zippo but it's cheaper and plasticier if they made a metal version I'd really like that and this uses um, again a blue sort of torch very similar to all the others just in a case a bit more like a zippo there's that and then we have the ultimate survival technology survival lighter which is probably the best of my torch lighters it's in a totally waterproof case where you can attach a lanyard to it there and then you have this um, jet lighter shorter flame than some of the others but still very hot and it has a light to tell you when it's on in case it's a bright day and you don't see the flame and this has quite good fuel economy even when set to high and the floating waterproof case is a really good design so it's a lot sturdy in the others and would be really good in a survival scenario well there you go that's all my lighters I've got a playlist of these so you can see all the lighters individually in there pretty much and apologies if I've forgotten any lighters I have but um, that's them uh, I just like lighters really they're cheap to buy for the most part the most expensive being the Zippo which was £10 um, the electric double arc light which was £20 and this which is about £15 but apart from that most of these lighters are a couple of quid to a fiver each so you know they're cheap compared to a lot of stuff I buy and they're cool pieces and you can do videos on them so anyway that's my complete lighter collection hope you liked it